Hi students, this is your science miss. In this session, we are going to continue with unit 6 microorganisms. In last video, we saw till the structure of the different microorganisms. Now, in this session, we are going to continue with uses and harmful effects of microorganisms. We are going to start with antibiotics. What are antibiotics? Antibiotic is a substance produced by living organisms which is toxic for other organisms. Antibiotic is first discovered by Sir Alexander Fleming. First uh, antibiotic is penicillin. It is derived from fungi Penicillium cryogenum. The next antibiotic is Streptomycetes. Recently, some Italian scientists uh, discovered a new antibiotic named as Pseudouridimycin from a soil which is used to cure bacterial infection. Vaccines. What are vaccines? Vaccines are prepared from dead or weakened organism. Vaccines are first discovered by Edward Jenner and the first vaccine is smallpox vaccine. MMR vaccine is given for measles, mumps and rubella. BCG vaccine is for tuberculosis. And the next use of the microorganism is agriculture. Ag uh, under the heading agriculture, the microorganisms are used as natural fertilizers, nitrogen fixing and bio control agents. Natural fertilizers, all microorganisms are decomposers and they help as natural fertilizers. Nitrogen fixation. Rhizobium bacteria living in the root of leguminous plants helps in nitrogen fixing. Uh, uh, cyanobacteria and nostoc also helps in nitrogen fixation. Biocontrol agents. Microbes are used to protect the crops from pest. And the next use is industry. Sewage treatment. In the anaerobic treatment of sewage, methanobacterium is used. Production of biogases, human and animal female matters and plant waste are broken down by anaerobic bacteria and produces methane gas and these bacteria are called methanogens. Production of alcohol and wine. Alcohol drinks are prepared by fermentation process using yeast and microorganisms in ritting and tanning industries. What is ritting? Flex plants are tied in bundles and kept in water. Bacteria loosens the supporting fibers of the stem by acting on the stem tissue. This process is known as retting. Um, Pseudomonas bacteria helps in retting. The next one is tanning. In tanning industry, bacteria act, act upon the skin of the animals and make it soft. Daily uses. For making bread, yeast is used in bakeries to make bread and cakes. Chlorella is as rich in protein and vitamins added to the dough which enrich the bread with nutrients. Preparation of curd and cottage cheese. Um, lactobacillus bacteria is used in the preparation of cur curd and cheese. In human intestine, lactobacillus and E. coli bacteria are present. Lactobacillus helps in the digestion of food and helps in fighting against the harmful diseases. E. coli bacteria helps in digesting, uh, synthesizing vitamin K and vitamin B complex. Harmful microorganisms. What are pathogens? A few microorganisms are harmful to human, animals and plants. They cause diseases and hence they are called as pathogens. Here they have given tabular column. Disease caused by microorganisms in human, in animals and in plants. In human Tuberculosis, cholera, 
common cold rabies amoebic dysentery malaria are the common diseases caused by microorganisms in animals anthrax and foot and mouth disease in plants citrus canker potato blight disease are the familiar diseases there is a more to know sleeping sickness is a disease caused by a tryptosoma protozoan and the host intermediate host is cc fly some microbes helps in food processing here we are going to continue with food preservation food preservation food preservation uh, uh, contains two techniques traditional technique and modern technique tradition technique consists of fermentation pickling sugaring boiling modern techniques includes pasteurization what is pasteurization it is a process of preservation of liquid food it is invented by louis pasteur milk is heated up to the 70 degree celsius to kill the bacteria and it is cooled to 10 degree celsius to prevent the growth of the remaining bacteria this process is called pasteurization probiotics what are probiotics probiotics are living food supplements used in yogurt and other fermented milk products an example for a probiotic is bifidobacterium it helps to repair stomach ulcer prions prions what are prions the word prion is derived from proteinaceous infectious particle a prion is a mutated form of a usually harmless protein virion what is virion if a virus is found outside the cell it is known as virion girls we have gone through a uh, microorganism lesson please go through the lesson and understand the concept find out the answers for the evaluation part thank you students